Delhi Transport Corporation DTC is the main public transport operator of Delhi. In 2014, the AAP government promised to make contractual DTC employees permanent. Four years later, over 10,000 employees are still waiting for the promise to be fulfilled. Each day, they live with the fear of losing their jobs. Manoj is a zonal president of the Mayapuri Bus Depot Workers Union. He mentions about the promises made by the government in 2014. In 2014, we were sitting in the Millennium Depot. That day, we remember today, when the Kedriwal government was made of 49 days. और उन्हें सात दिन के सरकार में जब हम सब चार पांच कर्मचारी अंशन में बैठे थे और वो हमारा अंशन तोड़वाने के लिए मिलेनियम डिपो आए और उन्होंने हमें लिखित में लिखित में दिया कि चार पांच महीने के अंदर हम कमेटी बना दी जाएगी और तुम्हें परमानेंट कर दिया जाएगा उन्हें सात दिन के सरकार के अंदर केजरीवाल no concrete decision has been taken yet on the issue. Khansha, who is a driver with the DTC for the last one decade, states that the existing discrimination between permanent and contractual workers is unfair. We are doing the same work that is permanent. We are doing the same work as we are doing the same work as permanent. Then we are doing the same work as we are doing the same work. We are doing the same work as we are doing the same work. According to legal experts, as per the 2016 agreement between the Delhi Transport Corporation and the Workers Union, contractual workers are granted the maximum of two years of service, post which it is subjected to renewal. Gopal Rai, who heads the Labour Ministry of the current AAP government, points out that the main roadblock is the central government. उसमें जो सर्विसेज है, जिसमें लोगों की भर्ती का, उनके पक्का करने का जो सारा सिस्टम होता है, वो केंद्र सरकार के माध्यम से एलजी के पास है। हम लोगों ने सरकार बनने के बाद दो-दो तीन-तीन बारे फाड़ किए, लेकिन बार-बार उसको रोक दिया जा रहा है। वो एक सबसे बड़ी बाधा है कि जिसकी वजह से the fight for seeking permanent status seems far from over. As of now, the matter rests with the Delhi Fast Track Court with the hearing scheduled on the 14th of August. Political parties at several points of time had tried to woo workers by going ahead and promising them the permanent status. However, one of the biggest hurdles in this case would be the lack of a proper mechanism which ensures this transition from contractual to permanent.